What's up, guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys this afternoon. Um, as you can see, the background is a little bit different. I am out at uh, the lake house, Lake Murray, South Carolina, um, in Chapin. Uh, if any of you guys are around here, then we're pretty close to each other. But I'm not here for Memorial Day weekend. I'm definitely going to be making a bunch of videos for you guys when I get uh, my breaks. I'm going to try and make one or two today, blah, 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 whatever, whatever. <laughs> Um, but today we are <clears throat> on uh, the Town Hall 9. We can go ahead and look around and look at that. <laughs> Another freaking gym box. They're spoiling me, you guys. I need to take a screenshot. Let me see if it even shows up on y'all's thing. Uh, me taking a screenshot. Yeah, it did. Um, why is it lagging right now? Did that fix it? Yeah. All right, so there's another freaking gym box. I don't even know. I think that's like number 13 or something on both of my accounts. So far, I just took a shower because I was out swimming in the lake. Um, but yeah, so what we're going to do, I'm going to show you all a new strategy that I've really, really enjoyed using lately. Um, I tweeted it the other day, and um, basically what it is, we'll watch this one right here. Look, those top three are all 100%. Um, and it's just mass giants, like 27 giants in all of them. And yeah, this base isn't that good, obviously. Um but the giants stay at max level giants stay alive for so long that it's just ridiculous. Like they're slow, so that's why you need um, jump spells and stuff like that. But you can see I'm just getting all my giants in down here at the bottom. Um, I just went ahead and raged the barbarian king to help take out that other king because giants aren't going to attack him because they're focused. They're focused troops, so they're only going after defenses. Um, and so yeah, you know, you just you use a couple jump spells and some heal spells. Uh, it lagged a little there. Um, sorry, I'm trying to figure out. I, I think that our internet's pretty good out here at the lake house, but um, yeah, it looks like it's going well now. So you use jump spells and heal spells, and then you have about ten wall breakers at, at first. Um, I didn't even realize that my sound was on. <laughs> we'll turn that off because that's probably making it lag a little bit. Um, so <clears throat> you can see. They, the, the Giants slowly work their way around, and once you clear out a pretty good um, amount of defenses, you can start dropping your other troops. Um, so I dropped some Wizards and the Archer Queen up here at the top. Some more Wall Breakers just to distract because I had some extras. And then you can see the Giants up at the top are still just working their way around. Dropped a Heal Spell on them. And then we drop all of our Goblins and Wizards up here in the top corner, and they're just going to go through the middle and just wreck it. And you don't have to use um, Wizards. Obviously, that's... Uh, really up to you. Um, there's a lag again. Uh, <laughs> but it's up to you whether or not you use wizards because they are kind of expensive. But I have enough elixir that it really isn't that big of an issue uh, for me. So you can see my giants are getting pretty low in health right now. Um, but And for some reason they didn't attack this archer tower down here in the bottom even though they went right by it. They worked their way around to the top. Um, so we have those wizards at the top, everybody's doing work, and then in that one gold mine right there was like 60,000 gold or something. Um, maybe 40, I don't know, something. It was a lot though. Um, so we can just finish that up, and they are going to get 100%. You can see all these giants are still left. Um, it does get really, really close to the clock, but I mean, look at that. That's 670,000 in resources and 100 um, or 1,100 dark elixir. So that's awesome. Try it out. It works really, really well. Um, I'm at the 1700 trophy range right now for Town Hall 9, and it's working really, really well for me. I'm finding a lot of good bases. I mean, we can come back in here, look at the attack log. So that top one is pretty much just as big, 294, 367, so on and so forth, all the way down. There's another 300,000 one. There's another 400, 500,000 one. So 1700 trophy range is working really, really good for anybody who's Town Hall 9 and you're looking to farm. Um, but we're already about four minutes into this video, and um, I want to go ahead and um, have an attack for you guys. Now, one thing that I do want y'all to let me know is what you think I should do with um, my gold at this point. Should I continue upgrading my defenses, or should I start working on my walls? Because walls are walls are very important. Um, so let me know down in the comments. This isn't a max out or anything. I'm just kind of showing you all the new strategy with um, with the giants. I forgot what I called it. It was like, uh, since there's goblins, giants, and wizards, it was like, um, I, I don't even know. I totally forgot. I'm drawing a blank. You get, Look at that. Nine gems from those two trees. Uh, you guys can follow me on Twitter, though, and, and see pictures and, and whatnot that I'm posting. But um, why don't we go ahead and go on the attack. I'm going to break my shield. 
going to try and attack a couple of times a day. And um, hopefully in a couple searches, we can find uh, a good base, but it looks like it's being slow. So I'll go ahead and cut here and I'll see you guys in just a couple of seconds. All right, so hold tight. All right, guys, so we are going to attack this base. As you can see, it's got some pretty good loot. Um, first, we're going to drop a giant over here to check on uh, the clan castle, and there's nothing in there. Um, <clears throat> so now that that is out of the way, <laughs> we're just going to uh, go ahead and drop down our giants down here, um, and then we're going to spread out... <clears throat> gosh. We're going to spread out our wizards. Let's see if we can uh, help our giants get into the base. Um, hopefully the wizards will do what I'm asking them to and focus on the king, but they are not doing that at all, which I'm really curious as to why they're doing. Um, there they go. So <laughs> please just go after the king. All right. So um, we're going to go ahead and drop down the rest of our giants over here. Uh, we already used all of our wall breakers. Um, and we'll drop off some wizards with them. We're going to use one of our jump spells right here, and what you really want to do is try and get it... How is that not on them? Look, that's totally on them. All right, well, we need to use a, uh, a heal spell. That's Sometimes that's... Did y'all see that? I just accidentally used one of my freaking jump spells over there on the left. And look, they're touching it. They're, they're lit up by the jump spell, and yet they're not going through there. Um, so they're working in the middle right now, which is good. Once we get this whole side done uh, with, the, with the defenses, we're going to go ahead and drop a heal spell right there to help keep all those guys up. We can start dropping off some of our goblins. And as you can see, like there was a mistake right there with those um, spells, but it's not going to affect us too much because um, we still have a minute and a half. The giants are distracting everybody. Um, and we have those hog riders helping us out. And in the middle, we just have all these goblins that are just going to work. Uh, we can drop off a couple up here, and they're going to... Uh, the defenses that are close to them... I don't know why they always switch like that. It shouldn't be focused on them. Um, but you can see all these giants in the middle are still doing really, really good work. The archer queen's being an idiot down here. <laughs> um, but up here at the top, we can drop off a couple more goblins, and those will take all of that out um, from those storages. Looks like we almost have that entire storage in the middle. Um, all of our giants are gone now. I'm going to drop off all 12 of these uh, goblins right here, and they're going to clean house when it comes to these last two uh, mines, and hopefully they can... No! No, get them. Please be out of range. So they're still in range of that wizard tower. <laughs> so there's 5,000 left, um, and we got 80%. That's really good loot, guys. That's awesome loot, even with that mistake with the jump spell. If I'd had that jump spell and I didn't have to... and I didn't mistap... Um, and if that first one was over just a little bit, um, even though the rim was touching him, it, it's kind of testy. Um, but look, that still ended up being really, really good. So this strategy is working well for me. I like it a lot. Um, we've gotten some pretty good loot from it so far. Um, but let me know what y'all want me to upgrade. I'm not going to upgrade anything yet. In fact, why don't y'all tweet at me, okay? So I'll upgrade um, whatever you guys tweet at me to upgrade. I know that I can upgrade my expos eventually, but they're going to be so expensive. Um, but once I do upgrade them, um, it's, they're going to be maxed out, and then they're going to be terrifying. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate y'all's support. Definitely look out for some more videos this weekend, and I hope that y'all have an awesome Memorial Day with your family and your friends. Um, and yeah, I'll see you later, guys. As always, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? See ya.